Greetings, this is Michael Earlywine, and uh, I've got a little blog for you. Even an eventful life, like many of us feel we have, is a long string of events punctuated by silence and a lack of events. After all, that's what makes them events. And in my opinion, a high-strung, active person can rest in the nature of the mind too in meditation, just as well as a stereo as the stereotype of a calm, even tempered person. It's all about resting, just as you are, warts and all, and it's not it's not personal. All of these worries in our life that pop up and shadow us have to be looked at, noted, and just set aside. There's nothing there worth worrying about. And I came across something that I wrote some 50 years ago, and so I'm going to quote it here from you. It just came from one of my journals. No matter what you think about me, about my person, I know in time you will learn to recognize me as like yourself, and you will love me as I have learned to love myself, as I have learned to love you like it or not. My person has not changed. How could it truly? For person is the product of time. And my person, like a freight train, rushes on at the future. It's, it always has. Only I, stepping off from my person and with you now. I am myself. I turned off time's endless matter at 30. I drop my body or sense of gravity. It proceeds on without me, or rather, with my perpetual care and love. But I am not only my person. I am as well one with the creator of my body, of any body. And my faith informs me. Each day's passage frees and reveals my past, presents my past, and clears it open where before was but an endless accumulation, layer on layer, is now removed with, with every passing day. And as these layers lift, it's clear to me that there's nothing there worth worrying. All of the past lives that I have in this life are presently living, have become clear. There's nothing to go back to, no place to hide, no cover. I am born free, and I'm held awake by all that lives. Where before I could not keep my eyes open, so now I cannot shut or close them, no, no closure. And from my subconscious pours my past, cloudiness clearing it is my present. My placenta is being born, turning out all of that which nourished me. And I can clearly see that all that clouds this stream of consciousness is but a searching, is itself but a frowning, a looking to see, a pause, a hesitation that caught and unfurled in the eddies of time, finding nothing becomes clear, and laughing, I leave it go clear, and turn from a darkening or dimming of my mind to light, and it came to pass, and I let it pass. Oh.